So friends, in my previous video, I have shown that how to make remote control fan and bulb, which was incomplete because of the lengthy time. And uh, from that video onwards, if you want to make this circuit, so please go for the video number one of remote control fan and bulb. And uh, let me continue from the last point. This uh, the parts I have arranged in the PCB and now it's the time for the remaining connections so let us start from the ground connection the number 2 microfarad PF LED LED 470 MUF all these points are here so let us start from the number 2 of the TSOP sensor Okay, let us check that which part has been connected so I have taken pin number 2 to the ground pin number 2 to the ground and condenser 100 muF 16 volt which is also being connected 47 muF and 25 volts also connected to the ground and 103 PF LED and and one more LED and uh, this is remaining and BC548 ammeter BC548 ammeter should be connected to the ground This 470 microfarad 25 volt is also connected to the ground. So our input will be this point means diode and negative of the condenser. And now let us connect this 7805. This point of 7805 IC this first point is the input that means 12 volt and this relay is also being operated at 12 volt so we have to give supply at this point and this point these two points have been connected and uh, this is coming to diode and positive of the condenser 470 mu f so let us connect it okay now this condition is fulfilled and now this is the the middle point of this IC 7805 is ground this 5 volt 5 volt supply should be given at pin number 16 a meter of the transistor and 10 ohm resistance connect this pin 8 number and 30 number pin together and which will go to the ground 8 and 13 
4 and 15 are joined together and number 4 1 2 3 4 and 16 15 you can connect it in this manner also earlier I have left the pin number 3 should be connected to the base pin number 3 of the sensor to be connected to the base so friends the circuit is almost ready and I am very extremely sorry for that I have mistaken one connection in the circuit diagram so the connection is that this collector wire of the transistor BC558 should be connected to the 40 number of the IC so let us connect it I am really sorry for that So the collector of the BC558 is now to be connected to the 14th number of the pin of the IC. Now the circuit is completed. So in this circuit we should also connect a wire so that it could be connected. this is a small wire and I am connecting collector this is the 14th pin number of the IC 16 15 14 and the collector of the transistor it should be connected over here so now the circuit is completed now it's the time for the testing it you can operate this whole circuit with the 9 volts of transformer or 12 volts of transformer according to the availability of the transformer to you so I am using it as 09 you can also use 12 volts of transformer it is working fine so connect one wire to the diode and one wire to the ground and now connect the this is the bulb wire these uh, this I have connected in series so that these two wires should be connected to the relay I am connecting these wires to the relay one is common this is the common wire this is the common point of the relay and one is to be connected at this point so this is the final circuit and final connection I am operating this at 9 volt of supply you can use 12 volt of supply for better results and uh, it also works on 9 volt of transformer so these are the connection this is this I have connected in series to the power supply and these two wires is uh, connected to the relay and I am just inserting the bulb and testing it plugging it into the power supply and this is the connection of the bulb so this is free to air DTH remote and let us see the result yes green indicates that the LED bulb is glowing and red is the symbol of cut so 
any type of remote you can use television remote music player remote mp3 player remote dth any kind of dth remote you can use because this works on infrared rays and uh, i have tried up to 15 meters of range it is working properly and uh, i am going at the corner of my room and uh, at present time i am at the corner of my 15 feet long room and from there it is also working so friends if you like this video i have done a lot of research work to make it perfect uh, so that you can also make it in a easy manner and that to the result should come in one one time efforts so this was all about remote controlled fan and light you can control it by the remote so friends i have done a lot of effort to making this and uh, to make this circuit this is the final circuit so please if you like this video then please do like and please share this videos as many as possible thanks for watching keep innovating thank you very much this was from innovative ideas please do a like click on like button thank you to subscribe innovative ideas click on subscribe button and click on bell icon